Welcome to Casting Cage. I'm your host, Tony Fontenot. Trout fishing out of Jugs Landing in Terrio, Louisiana today. I have a special guest, one of the best sockele fishermen I know, father of Dr. Bo Grafton, Dr. Hoy Grafton. Also on board, we have Captain Bill Lake of Bayou Guide Service. So get ready for an exciting half hour with Casting Cage. Pole. Fish on already? Drop it. Drop the pole. Power oh, pole. Oh. Let's sit right here. Drop the power pole. It's going down. Oh, oh yeah. Good keeper. That's a good fish. What'd you catch him on, Bill? A swim bait? Speckled trout? Huh? Man, I'd have to kill you if I told you. All I gotta do is watch the show. Bunker. Bunker. Bunker swim bait. Not a bad little trout for the first one of the day. Oh, we got that's okay. Fish on. Fish on again. On that left, on that right bank right there, Tony. Okay. Drop the pole again. Over here, Doc. Drop the pole. Dropping them right now. Bye, right, Captain. Poles dropped. Uh, we got a little 12 inch this yeah. time. They'll pop the grease though. Another nice little fish. There's one here right at the boat. Oh, a little one. A little killer shad worked. Well, I don't know. Combination of that and the spray. When you're catching a little trout that you're going to release, even if you like using a rag or a towel, it's best not to use it on them because you take a lot of the slime off of them, which protects them, and more of them will die. So just get your hand slimy and wipe it off on the towel after. Right back. Put him in the boat. There you go. Nice fish, nice fish. Fish are kind of finicky, so I'm going to downsize. I'm going to use a chartreuse shiny hiney with a chartreuse head with orange eyes and a little spray. Get him, Pep. 
right on the drop off. See that moving water on that on the drop off right there? 12 inches. That's all we need. All right, that's a good one. About a little 12 or 13. Oh, yes, shoot. That's bigger than that. 14. 14, 15. Nailed that swim bait. Good job, Captain. This little bayou right here is a major route for fish to migrate back and forth between this set of pipeline canals and the other set over there. So, I mean, there should be fish here. I mean, the, he the fish are here. Yeah. You know? There he is. Not much You have no all. choice yeah. now. We're gonna hold you down and find those baits. Ah, just a little one. No 12, 14 incher. Look at that. Oh yeah, he's good eating. Oh yeah. He'll make the cut. I'll tell you what, we better measure him anyway to be sure. Right there. Oh, let's see here. Yeah. Oh yeah. 12 and a half. Good deal. Oh boy. I took Captain Bill on the back of the boat to give Dr. Grafton and myself a chance. But he's still kicking our butts. And he wouldn't give me one of his baits. So I stole two of them. We should go check out Bay Long. I mean, there have been some good fish caught in there. Oh! Oh, what you got there, boy? That ain't no trout. No. That ain't no trout. I think I'm going to have to use my hands to grab that one. That's right. You didn't bring the net. No. I'll get him for you. If you get him to the boat and wear him out. No, I'm going to get him to what the boat. Red? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Beautiful red. I'm going to get him to the boat, cuz. Shake that head, baby. Shake it. Come on. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. You have to wear him down for yeah, you. Yeah, wear him down. Time. That's fine. Nice little red right there. Get on my knees. Hold still, baby. Hold still, hold still, would you? Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> That's one way to get him. <laughs> yeah, you're right. That's a red that Captain Bill and I caught. A little teamwork on that one. It's a good net, man, I tell you. We need to keep him on board. <laughs> I mean, that's a, just a classic example of where you should catch a fish at. Current moving around a point like that. Yeah, that's what's up. Oh, yeah, nice trout. Got one of Captain Bill's baits. Golden Bunker. That's one bait. And now I'm doing like him. Fish on. Power pole, baby. Power pole. Gotta get to my remote. I got it. Oh, big trout. Oh, big Doc's trout. Got one too. Ooh, yeah. Nice one, Doc. So now we know who taught Bo how to fish. <laughs> now the truth comes out. So who's a better fisher than you or Bo? Well, you know who taught him. That's it. It's got to be me. That's it. <laughs> Fish on. Fish on, baby. Fish on. Nice. Nice catch and release, too. Come on, baby. Ain't nowhere to go. As soon as it hits the water, is he hitting it? Mm, no, I'm swimming it. I'm not going as slow either. That's what I'm saying. I'm wondering if they'd hit it under a cork. Maybe. I got one right there if you want to try it. That uh, hiney, sh shiny hiney's tied on. I'm doing to you like you were doing to me a while ago. That's all right. Like this. Here it comes. Yeah. 
another little one. I uh, might miss this one. I don't know. Think it'll do B12? It'd be close. I'll measure. Pinch the tail. Oh, yeah, it's over 12 without pinching the tail. Good thing I checked.